Micro emulsions are a fascinating class of mixtures that exhibit unique properties due to their nanoscale structure and thermodynamic stability. Unlike regular emulsions, which require mechanical agitation to stay mixed, like oil and water shaken together, micro emulsions form spontaneously when the right balance of oil, water, and surfactants is achieved. But what makes these systems so special, and why are they important in fields like drug delivery, enhanced oil recovery, and nanotechnology? A microemulsion consists of three key components. A polar phase, water, a nonpolar phase, oil, and surfactants that stabilize the interface between them. These mixtures are classified into three main types, oil in water, O slash W, and bicontinuous microemulsions. Where water and oil form interpenetrating structures, the secret to their stability lies in the surfactants, which reduce interfacial tension and allow droplets to stay dispersed at the nanoscale, typically between 10 to 100 nanometers. Why don't microemulsions separate over time like regular emulsions? The answer is thermodynamic stability. In contrast to traditional emulsions, which are metastable and eventually break apart, microemulsions remain energetically favorable due to their optimal molecular arrangement. This self-assembling behavior makes them particularly attractive for applications where long-term stability is required. One of the most exciting uses of microemulsions is in drug delivery. Many pharmaceuticals are poorly water-soluble, making it difficult for the body to absorb them efficiently. Microemulsions help encapsulate these drugs in nano-sized droplets, increasing their solubility and bioavailability. In fact, some modern oral and topical medications already use microemulsion technology to improve drug absorption. But their usefulness extends far beyond medicine. Have you ever wondered how oil companies extract the last bits of oil from underground reservoirs? Microemulsions play a crucial role in enhanced oil recovery, EOR, where they help break down and mobilize trapped oil, allowing for more efficient extraction. They are also used in cosmetics, food processing, detergents, and uh, nanoparticle synthesis, demonstrating their versatility across multiple industries. Despite their advantages, microemulsions are not without challenges. Their formulation requires precise control of surfactant concentration, temperature, and phase ratios, as even minor changes can shift them out of equilibrium. Researchers are constantly exploring new surfactants and co-surfactants to optimize performance for different applications. Could microemulsions revolutionize nanotechnology and material science? Given their ability to form stable nanostructured environments, they are already being explored for use in nanoparticle synthesis, biomaterials, and even self-healing materials. Their potential is vast, and as our understanding of nanoscale science grows, so too does the range of possibilities for microemulsions in future technologies. What are microemulsions? Microemulsions are thermodynamically stable, isotropic mixtures of water, oil, and surfactants forming nanometer-sized droplets in a continuous phase. Unlike standard emulsions, which require mechanical energy to remain mixed, microemulsions self-assemble due to the balance of interfacial tensions at the nanoscale. They can exist in three primary forms, oil in water, O slash W, water in oil, W slash O, and bicontinuous structures depending on the ratio of components and surfactant properties. These systems are widely used in chemical synthesis, drug delivery, enhanced oil recovery, and food technology due to their stability and ability to solubilize otherwise immiscible substances. Microemulsions are used in pharmaceutical formulations to enhance the solubility and absorption of poorly water-soluble drugs. This is like using soap to mix oil and water, but at a much finer scale, forming stable and uniform nanodroplets. The role of surfactants in microemulsions. Surfactants play a critical role in microemulsion formation by reducing the interfacial tension between immiscible liquids allowing for stable nanodroplets to form. These molecules have hydrophilic, water-attracting, and hydrophobic, oil-attracting parts, enabling them to stabilize oil-water interfaces. The type of surfactant used, along with co-surfactants like alcohols, 
determines the microemulsion structure and stability. The selection of surfactants must balance hydrophilic lipophilic properties to achieve the desired phase behavior. Sodium dodecyl sulfate, SDS, is a common surfactant used in microemulsions to create oil in water system. Thermodynamic stability of microemulsions. Unlike regular emulsions which separate over time, microemulsions are thermodynamically stable due to their spontaneous formation. This stability arises from a balance of entropic, disorder-driven, and enthalpic energy-driven forces that prevent phase separation. Surfactants and cosurfactants lower the free energy of mixing, allowing microemulsions to remain indefinitely stable without external agitation. The Gibbs free energy equation determines whether a microemulsion will form with a negative Gibbs energy favoring spontaneous formation. Microemulsions are used in oil spill cleanup because their stability helps disperse oil droplets into the water for easier breakdown. This is like a perfectly mixed cocktail that never separates, no matter how long it sits. Microemulsion formation key parameters. Microemulsions form when oil, water, surfactants, and sometimes co-surfactants are combined under specific conditions. The phase behavior depends on temperature, surfactant concentration, and the water-to-oil ratio. A phase diagram known as a ternary or pseudo-ternary diagram is used to map out conditions where microemulsions exist. External factors like salinity, pH, and pressure can shift microemulsion stability, making them highly tunable for different applications. Uh, microemulsions are used in cosmetic formulations to deliver hydrating and oil-based ingredients efficiently. This is like finding the perfect mix of ingredients in a salad dressing so it never separates. Structure and types of microemulsions. Microemulsions can adopt different structures based on the ratio of water, oil, and surfactants. The three major types are oil and water, slash, W, water in oil, slash, O, and B, bicontinuous. In O slash W, microemulsions, nano droplets of oil are dispersed in water, making them ideal for drug delivery and detergents. In O slash O microemulsions, water droplets are capsulated in oil useful for reverse micelle application. Bicontinuous microemulsions form interconnected networks of oil and water, commonly found in industrial processes like enhanced oil recovery. Food grade microemulsions are used in flavor encapsulation to evenly distribute oil based flavors in water based beverages. This is like different types of marbles suspended in a gel like structure. Depending on their relative sizes and properties, microemulsions in drug delivery. Microemulsions are widely used in pharmaceuticals to enhance drug solubility, absorption, and bioavailability. Many drugs are poorly water-soluble, but microemulsions can encapsulate them in oil droplets, allowing better dispersion in the body. The nanoscale size of microemulsions also improves drug transport across biological membranes, enhancing therapeutic efficiency. These systems can be designed for controlled release, improving patient compliance and drug stability. Microemulsion-based cancer drug formulations help deliver chemotherapy drugs directly to tumor sites with reduced side effects. This is like encapsulating a vitamin in a soft gel capsule to make it easier to absorb in the body. Industrial and technological applications of microemulsions. Microemulsions have widespread applications in food science, nanotechnology, pharmaceuticals, cosmetics, and energy sectors. They are used in enhanced oil recovery to extract more petroleum from underground reservoirs by reducing oil viscosity. In nanotechnology, they serve as templates for nanoparticle synthesis, allowing precise control over size and morphology. Additionally, microemulsions are found in cleaning products, agrochemicals, and coatings, improving formulation efficiency and performance. Microemulsions are used in high-performance industrial lubricants to reduce wear and tear in machinery. This is like using an invisible lubricant to keep a machine running smoothly without ever drying out. Challenges in microemulsion stability and control. Despite their advantages, microemulsions face challenges related to stability, scalability, and environmental impact. Surfactant selection is crucial to prevent phase separation and maintain long-term stability under different conditions. Some formulations require high surfactant concentrations, which can lead to 
toxicity and unwanted environmental effects. Additionally, temperature fluctuations, ionic strength, and external forces can disrupt microemulsion structures, limiting their practical applications. Microemulsions used in pesticides must be carefully formulated to ensure stability in varying weather conditions. This is like keeping a delicate balance between ingredients in a recipe so the dish does not spoil too quickly. Future trends in microemulsion research. Ongoing research in microemulsions focuses on eco-friendly surfactants, biocompatible systems, and smart, responsible formulations. Advances in nanomedicine are integrating microemulsions with targeted drug delivery, enhancing treatment precision. Researchers are also exploring stimuli-responsive microemulsions that change properties under. Additionally, microemulsions are being investigated for renewable energy applications such as biofuel formulations and nanocatalysis. Smart microemulsions are being developed for responsive skincare products that adjust hydration levels based on humidity. This is like a smart thermostat that automatically adjusts to keep a room comfortable.